Okay, in this video, I would like to show you how to set up your Huawei MediaPad M2 tablet to use it with Mind Objects. So, first of all, we unpacked it. Now we need to start it. So, press the button on the side and wait for the device to boot. So, first we choose the language, we skip the internet connection for later, and also the SIM card, we don't have a SIM card right now. Also the fingerprint, you can set it up all later if you really need that, if you want to use it. Okay, let's have a look at the settings. Pull down the notification bar, then move over to the shortcuts and go for the settings. First of all, we don't want that the screen goes to sleep all the time when we think a little while looking on the screen. So go to display, then to the sleep functions and set it to 10 minutes. So this way it won't go into sleep mode that fast. Next thing we want to do is the, the bar down here. Sometimes if you write and put on your hand, it's um, opening things and, and stuff like that, which can be distracting. So go to Smart Assistant and then Navigation Bar. And now you can choose whether it's left, center or right, or like position it manually the way you want. So let's put it on the left side because I'm a right-handed person. This way it's easier. The next thing is sometimes you want to present something with a tablet or use mind objects while others look at the screen uh, on the projector and that can be very handy to see the touches of your fingers uh, on the screen then because the people don't see your fingers of course. Therefore, we use the settings of the developer options to show the touches. And first of all, um, you see we don't have the developer's options yet. We just go into About Tablet and hit the build number several times. So this way we enable the developer options. So now we have them here. And you don't need to enable anything except the show touches and this way you can see it when I use the pen here or the finger so this way um, people can see it on the screen no matter if they see your hands or not okay now we are prepared to install mind objects therefore just go to the play store so you can create a new account or use an old account so Let's just click create an account. Okay, now look for mind objects. And since we have a pen tablet with a Huawei MediaPad M2 Premium, we choose the mind objects pen version, which is called mind object think visual, and we install it. Now that we have installed it, let's have a look on the screens, how they work. So here we are. Now you can grab that and move it around wherever you like to put it. When we started for the first time, we are in the test period, which is 14 days of usage for free and of course you can get a quick start by some screens but you can also just right away uh, start using it and you can always 
get the screens again from the beginning on the question mark over here um, or create in the dashboard new canvases.